Well, look at this. My little squirrel friend is back. Yeah, aren't you a cute one? Oops, ha, <laughs> that's the flower. Yeah, enjoying those seeds, are ya? Yeah, Tina's pretty loud. Maybe Tina would like some sunflower seeds. I don't know if Tina can have sunflower seeds. Surely he can. Oh, um, yeah. Tina, you're mighty loud in there. Why are you so loud? Oh, oh. There, you need to be a little bit more quiet. Okay, good morning to you. I didn't record as I was walking through the woods because the ground is mushy and I didn't want to fall through the snow. But check this out. The snow is melting. Wow. And back here, I know it looks like a mess. I don't even know if you can see that. Back there, the snow is all melting. You can see the fencing that's all smashed by the snow. The geese are saying, shut up, come let us out. Okay, I will do that. I just wanted to show how there is bare ground in spots in the woods. Yeah, the snowpack is melting. I got Piper to come back here with me today. Well, I mean, I just say, you guys want to go out and let the geese out? That's what I say to the dogs. Piper followed me. Samson was laying outside. He just looked up at me with his puppy dog eyes. I said, okay, don't come with me. It's up to you. This is the reality of how things look in the spring. Look at that. Isn't that, that's nasty. That's been gradually, over the winter, we'll feed the geese, the geese will do their business, and then the next snow will come. But as the snow is melting, it's exposing all of that, all of that nastiness. Yeah. Oh, oh, talk about nastiness. Piper must have just pooped somewhere because I got a whiff of it. Oh, Piper, that's nasty. What you been eating? Uh, okay, I'm gonna let the geese out. All right, and they cleaned out the goose box and put fresh stuff in. And I hope you can hear me over the geese. Let's see. Here's the problem. That's my path. I gotta go past Ernie. This is my bag. All right. I can, I can keep them away from me. Let me pass, let me pass. No, don't attack me, don't attack me. Okay, that was only a little bit scary. I do have long underwear on today still though, so if they bit my pants and bit my long, threw my pants to my long underwear to my skin, it probably wouldn't hurt too bad, but I'll tell you when they bite, they can leave bruises, big bruises. So you think they'd be grateful I let them out, but no, my stairs are coming back. Ooh, little doggy. It's hard to walk on the snow. Yeah, yeah, for me too. Yeah, you nice puppy. Yeah. Can you hear what I hear? I hear geese flying north. Not my geese. The Canada geese. Oh, there's still snow, but it's melting. Our walk was so nice last night that uh, we decided to go again tonight. And, and, Except and she's freezing and she says, where's my long underwear? Yeah, no kidding. Where's my long underwear? That's just what I was going to say. Well, not exactly. I was going to say, it's colder tonight. Can you see my breath yet? And I was out in a t-shirt working on the car. Oh, you're crazy. Hey, I took my
my jacket off too to work on the goose pen. Oh, I think it's just well, the you. Sun was probably shining. It was then. hot. It's not shining now. I went out with gloves up. and my big jacket, <laughs> and I was burning. Uh, you want to say that on camera? Here we go. No, no. She I said want... it on camera. <laughs> so we are out for a walk. Social distancing. Social distancing together. At least we can do it together. <laughs> Do you hear the birds? I don't know what kind that is. There's more than one out here. I heard some ducks. And I heard it was a full moon tonight. Looks full. And look at who's sitting out in the snow. Samson doesn't want to come in the house. Maybe he's enjoying the birds. <laughs> there are a lot of different bird sounds out here. Um. <laughs> and just like that, he decided to come in.